Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. We went for our monthly shopping at Aldi. Let's see what we got. So first thing is they had their steamed winter blend because it's this with their seasonal stuff. This is just broccoli and cauliflower. I love it. I got two bags of that. We got two bags of steamed cut green beans. One bag of the Asian medley. This is seasoned already. And um, Jim and I like this. We just microwave one of those 90 second rices and this with possibly some like grilled chicken or something and then that's a meal for us. Uh, also this super sweet corn steamer bags, we got two of those and we needed two more bags of broccoli for our florets. Um, for our monthly shopping, if you're new around here, what we do is we get frozen vegetables. Once they're fresh have run out, then we use the frozen vegetables. I got three chicken cordon bleus, the um, Kirkwood brand. Uh, if you've been around for a while, you know that Mom and Jim used to get Cordon Bleu and I would get broccoli and cheese. They just haven't had the broccoli and cheese the last two times we shopped. I got a, I know you can't call them half gallons anymore. Uh, two, what is it, one and a half quarts? I don't know. What is it, three quarts? Three pints. Three pints, that's it, of mint chocolate chip ice cream by Belmont. That's my favorite. It's sort of like Briars where it's like not really green, which I like. Um, mom needed egg whites. This is 16 ounces of the Fit and Active brand of egg whites. We got a gallon of whole milk. And Jim picked up a, a pound of his bacon ranch chicken salad. He really likes this one. Um, we picked up some Mexican style cheese. If you've been around for a while, you know that the taco cheese with the seasons in it. It's how we make our um, quiche and stuff, and I use that in a lot of recipes, but I didn't find any at Walmart. I didn't find any at, well, Aldi doesn't carry the one with seasoning in it, so I just end up getting this. I can always add my own seasonings. We got 16 slices, which is 12 ounces of American cheese singles. That is the Happy Farmer brand, which is the Aldi brand. We got the Breakfast Best Heat and Serve Sausage. This is 10 links. This is pork sausage. Um, and we got five boxes. And we got two uh, of the Flaky Layer Biscuits. I use these in a lot of recipes, plus we just like them for breakfast. Um, and they each have eight biscuits in them each, and they're each 16 ounces. Okay, so we got two dozen large eggs. This is from Golden Hen. These are my favorite eggs. Um, we got just two dozen because that's all we needed. Um, Jim found these. They're a seasonal baking item from Village Bakery. Um, there are only six donuts in there for $1.99, but he said he couldn't wait to try them because they're apple cider donuts. Yum, yum. Um, we picked up a pound of green beans. These are whole green beans, as well as a head of iceberg lettuce. Um, this is by, this is an each, not a per pound situation, as well as eight ounces of white mushrooms. I see steak and potatoes in my future. Um, and then, of course, the two heads of broccoli. This bag just recently opened, like just now, um, when I was moving it out of the bag, so sorry about that. <sighs> Mom got her loaf of whole grain bread. Jim and I just realized that we forgot to buy bread. <laughs> so what we have over here is um, Italian croutons. This is from Tuscan Gardens. And then we got some classic Caesar croutons. Classic Caesar croutons are a little bit garlicky. Um, the Italian seasoned ones are a little bit more flavored with other things as well. We needed a can of plain bread crumbs. When I grew up, we only had Italian flavored breadcrumbs. We didn't even know plain existed until one day you accidentally bought them and your father yelled at you. Just saying. Um, you get 15 ounces. Speaking of 15 ounces, oh, that's 16. We got fat-free refried beans. This is from Mama uh, Casa Mamita. Casa Mamita, that's what it is. That's the Aldi's brand of Hispanic food. And we got one more can of corned beef hash because we only ate one since we went shopping last. And then I picked up a can of packed pumpkin, 100% pure pumpkin, um, not pie filling. This is 15 ounces. I'm going to make Jim a pie. 
for his birthday, probably. And then this is a can of evaporated milk. This is 12 ounces. So that's, if you're ever gonna make a pie, you know you need both of those. I talked about the mushrooms, thank Kenny. And the donuts and the eggs, I'm all done with them. My helper, he's such a good helper. Everybody give Jim a thumbs up. For putting all the groceries away while I'm hauling. When I was in Texas, uh, I stayed with Eden, as you know, and Eden and Anthony always have like corn tortillas for taco night. And I was like, well, hello, why not? Because I can eat all the corn I want, right? So we picked up, this is a 30 count of the corn tortillas by Pueblo Lindo. Sorry if I'm butchering that name. We needed olive oil, so we got this, um, what is that? 16.9 ounce pint, uh, what is it, liter? Yeah, half liter, how's that go? Of olive oil. That is the Carlini brand. And then Carlini, we needed some canola oil. So this is, um, so I say 48 ounces. We picked up some tuna. This is chunk light in water. This is what I like to have because it's less expensive than the chunk solid white. And you know, solid white's a million dollars. Um, this is yellow mustard we needed. This is Berman's brand. It is 20 ounces. Let's say 20. Yeah. Mom picked up these 100 calorie packs of baked chocolate chip cookies she wanted to try. Now, you know, I love this Earthly Grains uh, Tuscan grain salad, and it was so good. Jimmy tried it, and he loved it so much that he said, I said to him, Do you want to try the Southwest one this time? And he said, Sure. So we're going to try that, and we'll let you know how it is. He wanted to try the Clancy's brand of Pringles. Um, these are stackers, sour cream and onion. And they're the same size, I think 5.9 ounces. We got, um, they had pumpkin spice K-Cups, which they often come out with their seasonal K-Cups. You get 12 for $3.99. So if you've been around a while, you know I won't spend more than three for a dollar for a K-Cup. Four for a dollar is better, but I won't spend more than 33 cents for a K-Cup. <laughs> um, he also got these, which he saw because it was Oktoberfest, and um, Mom said that these were his grandpa's favorite cookies, and for 21 ounces for $1.99, he thought he would give them a try. He loves all the things. He loves cinnamon, and he loves spices and all that stuff, so. Mom got a bag of Twix. Um, she'll probably eat all the left side ones, and you know, because she's a lefty. No, I'm just kidding. Um, I'm sure the right side ones upside down. <laughs> that's it. They're 10.53 ounces. Could you guys see that with the gold? Yeah. And then the Milky Ways for you, Mama Jim. Okay. And then she got Milky Ways, 10.69 ounces. I asked because Milky Ways is Jim's favorite. Um, they only had one of the 90 second brown rice. So Jim wants said, oh, we know what? We like the chicken. Why don't you go ahead and get the 90 second chicken rice? So we got that as well. And then the last thing from Aldi's is four packets of roasted garlic potatoes by Ida Hoen. These are four half cup servings. Um, and I've told you guys before, but I'll tell you again, this is just mixed boiled water, mix it in there, but we actually always substitute milk for water and we always add butter. That's what we do, make them different. And we get 10 pounds of russet potatoes and we split them with a friend. So it's a great bargain that way. <sighs> I know, it wipes me out. <laughs> so that's everything from Aldi. Can't wait to have some chicken salad. We had a chicken salad story from yesterday. Can't wait to tell you. No, you don't want me to share it? I'll share it. Too bad. No, it's my chicken salad. Get him. None of them. Oh, you're not sharing no, the chicken salad? No, I'm not sharing. Oh. No, no. That's not after last night. That's a different story. Not after last night. Just a little story. Jim and I went to um, St. Louis yesterday to help Aunt Sue and get some stuff from her. And we, um, I've mentioned it before, we have T-Mobile. And on Tuesday, T-Mobile gives away lots of stuff. And one of the things they give away often is $2 gift cards to Dunkin' Donuts. Well, they build up over time because we don't have a Dunkin' Donuts by us. So we were on a budget yesterday. We basically put all of our money into gas and then my friend gifted us money to go to get Drake's Cakes because now they sell them in Missouri. Oh my gosh, it was, it was so exciting. But anyway, one of the things we said we would do was 
go to Dunkin' Donuts for chicken salad on multigrain bagels, which we used to get once every other week. I used to get paid every other week when I worked in New York, and it was sort of like a tradition for us. Like at least one day every other week, we would have either have it for lunch or dinner. So Lupper. last night, Lupper, right, exactly. So last night we were leaving and Aunt Sue said, I wanted to take you guys out to dinner because of all your help. And I was like, no, it's okay. I still turned to Jim and I was like, do you want to go out to dinner or do you just want to get your chicken salad? He's like, I just want my chicken salad. So I was like, okay. So we leave her house. We drive about five minutes down the road west from where she lives is the nearest Dunkin' Donuts. We pull in and I said, do you have multigrain bagels? She's like, yeah, I have three left. I was like, oh, great. Can we have chicken salad on multigrain bagels? She said, sorry, they discontinued the chicken salad in February. Wah, wah, wah. He was very sad. <laughs> no more Dunkin' Donuts. I boycott Dunkin' Donuts. They've dunked. So, and I said to him, I'm like, do you want something else? Because this is where we have money for dinner or whatever. And he's like, he's like, no, I'm good. And of course he was hungry, so he wasn't good. And we don't live, we live... Uh, and about an hour and 15 minutes was the trip home. But we were also stopping at Target to get the Drake's cakes. So I was like, I could just forget the Drake's cakes. I could just buy us dinner. And he's like, no. He's like, it's a, you know, Sharon gave it to you. Oh, Sharon. My, your friend gave that to you for Drake's cakes. And I was like, yeah, but, you know, you need to eat. And we were it at the Target getting the Drake's cakes. And... I opened my phone and I looked through all my apps and we had Chick-fil-A money. I had money still on my Chick-fil-A card from when I was in Texas. <sighs> so I said to him, I was like, all right, I'll get you Chick-fil-A and then I can just go get Dunkin' Donuts. I can get a sandwich or something. Well, when I opened my Chick-fil-A app, it said I had enough points to earn a free sandwich. So I was so excited. So he got a spicy chicken sandwich. Nice. I got my grilled chicken sandwich, and then he got a large fries we were able to get for $7, which is so, it was, it was such a nice dinner. He had soda, and I had my iced coffee, so we were set. In fact, the iced coffee was free. It was my free mm -hmm. rewards iced coffee. So it was a really, it was fun. We had a good day. Mm -hmm. I love you. So, ba bad situation. He got his chicken salad today, so that's that story. Bang, 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 <laughs> bang, bang. Sorry, I shake the phone when I left. So, um, if you have any questions, leave them in the comments down below. Give Jim a thumbs up for being a hero, for overcoming his chicken salad controversies. And if you haven't yet, click subscribe, and when you do, a little bell will pop up. When you ring that bell, YouTube will let you know whenever I upload a new video. And as always, take care, God bless. See you next time. Bye. Bye. Bye.